Welcome to Old Town Selena. Estimated 1856. What is up, YouTube, and welcome to another Crib Zone excursion. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up, subscribe for more. Direct you have a boner. No. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. If you guys are old to the channel, welcome. This is our old town where some of the clubs, movie theater, right here at nighttime, it gets really popping, especially the weekends. A popular video I filmed here was the National Dog Day video. That was filmed here in Old Town. That was a special event. It came next year and it wasn't there. I was sad. They actually built a roundabout around a year ago and they're actually planning to build more roundabouts because there's a ton of bad streets and intersections and car accidents. You know, I used to stop for civilians that were trying to cross like that. They just make it even more dangerous to stop for them. So, I'm sorry pedestrians. I'm gonna run your ass over. This thing's freshly oil changed. This thing's freshly filled up with 91 octane. The motorcycle I'm currently riding is a 2002 Ninja 500R. It's not a super sport, so it's not gonna have the brakes of a super sport. It's not gonna have the speed of a super sport. It does have a full Acrovic exhaust. Leads me to the biggest reason KZE owns a motorcycle. Lane splitting. Only legal in California. That's pretty much the biggest reason why I got a motorcycle. Lane splitting is going to have to be my favorite thing about riding a motorcycle. Like, look at that. That looks so good. KZE, it's so freaking dangerous. Why would you lane split? A couple reasons why it's legalized in Cali. It's much safer waiting in between cars. Hold up, one second. Make sure no motorcycles coming. going 10 miles per hour faster than the moving traffic when you're lane splitting. But who looks at the damn speedo? The speedo on my DRZ doesn't even work. Look at this! Look how amazing this looks! It looks like my ex is old! Look at this one! This one's nice! Jeez, that's a nice one. I don't want to hit this one. The mystery of almost dying or I don't know what it is. Oh, look at that, that's nice. Or just seeing stuff. Probably an accident. Let's get to the bottom of this. Just, never mind, I'm not gonna say it. And this guy's on his phone over here. Cute doggy, cute doggy. This is pretty much what you have to be careful of. Cars like this is wanting to cross over. When there's a gap, you just gotta time things nicely. Look at this guy. because there was a cop. Wow. Salinas itself is known as the salad bowl of the world. I don't know if you guys noticed in my videos, but there's fields everywhere. Dog park videos, there's a lot of comments where there's people saying, oh, there's a lot of Mexicans there. 
Yes, because there's a bunch of fans everywhere. Travel anywhere other than Salinas, and the people are going to be extremely diverse. Here in Salinas, mostly all Mexicans. In case you're looking for a job, uh, child support ain't going to pay itself. Still have no babies, I'm just kidding, okay? Oh, motorcycle gang. Oh no, it's a motorcycle gang gang. Everywhere around Salinas, there are fields. Another reason why the vein splitting is legal here. Bikes need air flowing through them to keep them cool. So if you're stationary all the time, then your motorcycle can overheat. But if you're lane splitting through cars, even if it's slowly, that airflow helps keep your motorcycle nice and cool. Through the back roads right here. They built this load probably like two years ago, I don't remember, but this wasn't here. They just completely built a huge load. Trying to compete with Walmart across the street. Okay, E, what the hell can be the reason why you'd actually leave this California? The biggest reason most definitely would have to be the weather. Heat storms going around the US, not Salinas. The reason for that is that we are slightly close to the ocean, around 30 minutes from the ocean. Definitely carries over here. The goal is to move out to Seaside, California, which is around 30 minutes from here. The mist in the morning. The coldness is just so amazing. I completely love that weather. If I was to ever move out of Salinas, California, I'd have to move to the neighbor city, which is Seaside. Probably the biggest house here in Salinas is owned by George Lopez. He owns a house going to Castroville. Well, it's not even a house, it's a mansion, but George Lopez owns land in Salinas. That's how much he knows that agriculture is popping here. It just smells like strawberries here. It just, like it just smells like strawberries. Okay, did, you eat? did your ex smell like strawberries? Shut the hell up! When Selena doesn't smell like strawberries, it smells like straight dank. It wouldn't be right to show you guys my city without taking you guys through my favorite route. I have visited a flat state. I would never ever in my life live in a flat area. Being able to see a mile ahead, in my opinion, is horrible. This is where all the rich people keep their kids. Favorite moto vlogger would have to be Baker X Derek. Go ahead and say that this is my mansion hilltop. It's a wee bit better than Baker X Dickheads. I've been craving a nice ride to LA. Lane splitting there would be so good. There'd probably be a ton of motorcycles there. Ow. One of my old jobs was working in a motorcycle center. My old boss would always throw me at the females. I dropped off the motorcycle at her house. She was into dogs. It was amazing. It hasn't really rained. That's why it's all yellow. But when it rains, everything's green. Okay, oh, ZE, why the hell aren't you posting videos anymore? It's just like these huge knocker mountains. Everything has ups and downs. Big update on the birds. Um, I put the female back in the cage yesterday. And dude, new bird took literally less than 24 hours to be gut deep inside of her. I do have a bird video coming up. Everybody cross their monkey fingers and hope that KZE will be a daddy of baby cockatiels. Oh, that'd be so cute. I'll run your ass over, score. I don't care. You think I'll stop that? When you're turning, you always want to break before a turn. Look at that. Look at that. And this is, whoa! <laughs> um, I hope that's controlled, because I'm not calling nobody. Look how peaceful this is. Nobody here, except for that car coming, but the hawk family, just hawking around. You know, sadly no cows around. The forest fire just burning, completely burning in the background. It's crazy just thinking that all this is private property, you know? Who the hell owns this? Who? George Lopez owns it, that's who. No, I'm just playing. Also crazy how I've never seen a bald eagle. I thought this was a miracle. Yeah. Not America enough. Sometimes you just gotta put it in neutral and let Jesus take the wheel. When you're going downhill, you wanna stay at a lower gear so the engine could break for you. 
or else you're really gonna kill your brakes. Now that I've shown you guys what my city's like, I want you guys to go down in the comments, let me know where you guys are from, and let me know specifics of your city, what you like about your city, what you don't like about the city. Let's make the comment section interesting in this video. And if you have any motorcycle related questions, go ahead and hashtag them, hashtag Q&A. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up, subscribe for more, peace! Feel free to follow me on Instagram and on Snapchat at KZ underscore production.